The derogatory remarks passed today on the floor of the house by a senior minister, senior in terms of the number of years Khwaja Asif Saab has spent in politics and also the portfolio he carries comes not only as a shock because I thought that after spending so many years and actually experiencing the number of women politicians increasing not only in the parliament but in active politics probably there is you know an acceptability of now women in politics in all spheres of life we talk about women empowerment few days back prime minister of pakistan ha- was you know addressing one of the event and he was said that women constitute mostly half the population of pakistan and if we do not empower them we cannot progress but if you have such mindset still in the parliament and in your party i don't know how we're going to ever change this so i think khwaja asif should uh, not only apologize for his statement for his remarks and he should realize you know you could have political opponents but this is not how you're going to deal with them because every woman's respect uh, you know every woman in that house carries respect could be your opponent could be in your party today you're doing it to another party just because they're your opponents tomorrow it's going to come back to you and you have a woman chief organizer as a part you know in your own party so are you trying to also say that you do not have the same kind of respect for Maryam Nawaz Saiba or you're just going to respect because PMLN's Supremo's, Supremo's daughter is Maryam Nawaz. Today I'm really, really taken aback that nothing has changed in Pakistan, really nothing has changed.